here as quick as I could. What happened? I what did the police say? I don't know. I, I, I don't know anything. All I know is that whoever did this, I'm gonna find him. And when I do, I'm gonna kill him. Do you know who did this to them? No. Why? I can tell that you're hiding something from me. Mrs. Thomas's condition is just barely stable. She insists on speaking with you, and I think you should do it. Henry. She's quite weak, actually. Go ahead. Mom, are, are you okay? Who did this to you? Things are not so simple, son. These were not ordinary people. They were moving as fast as the wind. You couldn't even see them. Somebody stepped into the house. And they disappeared. And then after that, the police came. Are you saying there was more than one person? Yes. Yes, exactly. Oh, Henry. We love you so much, your father and I. I'm so sorry. I know you've been through a lot lately, Henry. I'm so sorry. Don't say that. Son, listen. Everyone in this world... Oh, no, Henry, no, not till I tell you this. All I need from you right now is your forgiveness, son. Forgiveness, Mom? What are you, what are you talking about? <laughs> We're so sorry. Please forgive us. How did we know it would be true? Mom, forgive you? What, what, are, you, what are you saying? For what? what? <clears throat> Everything. Everything he told us. Oh my God, Henry. Everything he told us. It's all coming true. Mom, what are you, what are you talking about? What, what's coming true? Who is he? Henry. Henry. Your biological father. But you're, you're my parents. Yes, yes, of course. It's true. But, Henry, we found you. We found you when you were a baby. Your dad. He was a doctor and a very good friend. He spent most of his time in Africa. That's where you were born, Henry. But something strange happened on the day that you were born. He said that a man came to him and, and told him and that told him that, that you were the promise to a great future. And that you were the chosen one. And one day, you would be able to fight the evil. Son, son, don't cry. Don't cry, Henry. Listen, you're a grown man. Always be here for you, Henry. You gave us a desire to live and a more deeper meaning to our own lives. But you, you have to go on now and don't worry about me. Your father, he's already in a good place, Henry. You have to go on now without us. I'm going to be leaving soon. Mom. I love you, Henry. I Mom? love you so much. Uh, 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 we need a doctor, doctor. Uh, we need a doctor in here. We need a doctor. Uh, 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 Henry, right outside. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Mrs. Thomas. Mrs. Thomas.
sorry. with me. No, I don't think that's a good idea, all right? I mean, I don't want anybody else's life put in danger, especially yours, all right? And how? Are you trying to say that whoever did that to your parents are really after you? What the hell is going on, Henry? Wait, wait, I, I don't understand. Look, just give me some names and I guarantee that I can protect both of you guys. What do you mean you don't understand? Sir, 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 what do you mean? Where, where were your guys when my parents were being attacked? Where the fuck were they then, huh? Let me tell you something, there ain't nothing you or any other fucking cop can do. I have to take my own responsibility. I have to do what I was meant to do. Look, can I have a moment alone with Kelsey? But, Henry, look, don't play the hero, okay? The last thing we need is another dead body. I'll keep that in mind. I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to go away for a while. Where are you going? Let me come with you. You don't understand. I have to go. I want you to know that I will always love you. If you loved me, you wouldn't leave me. Ron, what about your promotions? Please, stay with me. I need you. Why do you have to go chase people you don't even know? Why can't you just let the cops do their job? Because I'm different now. I'm no longer the person you thought I was. I'm not him anymore. I'm sorry. Who's that? Probably just dad. Probably just checking in on you. And they have a lot of questions, Henry. The answers are new. You must decide quickly because they have found you. They are from an old tribe, very secret, very powerful. Or you could not even imagine. These people are like vampires, sucking the blood from their victims, using human organs to increase their power. I don't give a damn about your story. Why can't you just do it yourself? I, I cannot. It's not my mission. I want one thing, to find who did this to my parents and that's all I need your help for. 
Everything you need, Henry. It's in here. You got it. Now come, we must leave. It is not safe here. Let's go. <laughs> 